What is up, you guys? Happy Ash Monday, even though today is Monday. Even though today is Monday. I don't know if y'all can hear me. Hold on. Because Elijah. Huh. Sorry, but I can't hear her. Okay. Well, welcome back to my channel, you guys. Happy Ash. You can't even see me. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Happy Ash Monday. Whatever day this is. Don't know what day this video is coming out. Is this camera dirty? Okay. But yeah, I don't know what day this video is going to come out. Today is Monday. So I should be posting a video right now, but I'm not. <laughs> I have just been... Mm. <laughs> I don't know what it is i'm just in a rut where i just feel like i don't want to be online so i don't even know if i'm going to post this vlog honestly because i don't really have nothing to do but we're gonna roll with it so for the first time in a long time i decided to hey b say hi hi y'all can't see him but for the first time in a long time i decided to do a day in the life video yes the motherhood content is coming back you guys um oh i'm sorry if you're new here my name is ashley nice to meet you elijah you want to say hi mm. ah, don't mind his hair y'all we, we, we gonna do that today but yeah if you're new here i'm ashley i make motherhood lifestyle hair con i really just make whatever kind of content i want honestly but yeah um if you're new here i used to do motherhood content before i started doing the lock content and i took a break from motherhood content um and now we're back on it now we're gonna do a day in the life video um it is it is 10 40 a.m i've been up since seven i've really been up since like 6 45 but um i wasn't gonna pick up the camera at that er, that time because i'm not about that life i'll be tired y'all so i'm just up i'm gonna clean my kitchen my kids had breakfast so I'm about to clean my kitchen and get ready for the day. Today's day is August 8th. So the kids are in school. <laughs> they upstairs. They're doing virtual again this year. Um, are y'all kids doing virtual? Or are they at regular school? My kids wanted to go to regular school, but I said they're doing virtual this year for many reasons. We'll talk about that later. I don't feel like talking about that right now. But um yeah, so I'm just up. I'm having my coffee, trying to get my day started. I'm going to need two cups of coffee today because it's a Monday. And Mondays are always double cup days. I feel like each time y'all see me, I look a mess. But I did get a retwist. I took my style down like, the day before yesterday. I didn't want to have it up anymore. So it's just, it's just, you know, doing what it do. I'll let y'all see my life. They are definitely, oh, it's hot. They are definitely growing. They're looking so good, so moisturized. They're getting so long. Like, this one here is so long. Dang, let me pick you up. All right, this one right here is so long. Like, it just be sitting on my shoulder, like, just flipping out now. I don't know if that's a sign that all the other ones are about to catch up, but they need to hurry up because I'm tired of these looking so short. Um, these are shorter because I had um, postpartum shedding right before I started my locks. So this is all postpartum hair growth. So I'll grew back. So. No, look, y'all can talk about me all y'all want. I don't really care. But yeah, I don't really have anything planned today, you guys. I just picked up the camera at random. I know I look a mess. I just threw on some shorts and some, well, this is Aaron's jacket. I don't have a bra on, so I'll put this on because I'm not gonna put a bra on to film this video. Yeah, so that's what we're doing today, y'all. I don't have anything planned, so I don't know if this is gonna be boring or not. While I'm editing, if I feel like this is too boring to watch, you guys will never see this footage. So if you're seeing this, that means it made the cut. So we shall see. Huh? 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 Uh, I don't know where 
what we not gonna do. Come back, E. Come here. I'm done y'all I'm done scheduling my stuff for today I'm done making my to-do list I am very happy right now because at first I started to feel a little discouraged I'm looking for a tutor for my kids and I don't know if it's a Georgia thing or if it's like just everybody but Georgia has like the worst customer service ever like oh my gosh I hate calling people and they have bad customer service skills Elijah Leave my plants alone. <laughs> but I just got off the phone with this lady and she just made my day. She was so helpful. She gave me all the information I needed to know. She's gonna email me. So I have on my email. Look at my hair. But yeah, she she's really good. The first two people I called trash. But this third place is really good. So I'm about to get them set up for tutoring. And then I need to schedule some doctor's appointments. I need to get on birth control, y'all, because you won't catch me pregnant again. So I need to call my doctor and make a doctor's appointment. So I'm gonna finish all that up and then I'm gonna go downstairs and wash Elijah's hair and start getting him done. Oh my gosh, this child is like messing up this office. It's stressing me out. <laughs> See y'all what happened with the first person. So the first person that I met with for tutoring, well, the first person I contacted, she was supposed to, we talked and she gave me a lot of good information and she was supposed to um, email me some information regarding the tutoring and, you know, so that we can get started on finding a good match for the kids. But anyway, yeah, she was supposed to email me some stuff so I can get started with tutoring for my kids. So, I'm waiting on the email. The email never came, so I called back to schedule another consultation like a few days later. Mm. We scheduled it for 4 o'clock. This lady comes texting me at like 3-something talking about, can we hi Miss Hughley, can we meet at 6? So, at this point, I'm already annoyed because why you can't call me at 4? But anyway, sure, we can meet at 6. That's no problem. I'm waiting by my phone at 6. It's 6.05, 6.10, 6.20, 6.27. My phone rang. <laughs> Ma'am, I am not on your time. Like, I don't understand what part of that, like, y'all don't understand. I am not on your time. So, <laughs> needless to say, we wrap that up. I'm not going to go with that company. So then today, I called another company for tutoring. And it was a man who answered the phone, whole new company. And, <laughs> and so I called and he was like so nonchalant. Like, it's almost as if... He didn't feel like being at work. I understand it's Monday. That's not my business though. I'm asking you a question about your company. You need to be able to tell me some information. This man was like, I was like, um, yes, I want to know, you know, get some information about your tutoring program there. Yeah, so what do you want to know? And I was on the phone like, I mean, pricing, how you guys match tutors. Are you virtual or in person? Um... How do you charge? Is it by the month or by the hour? Like, you know what I mean? You should have some type of basic information to give me as a potential client, right? I had to guide him through the conversation. I'm not going to do all that. So, he's like, oh, well, do you want me to email you? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it because you done made me mad. Get off my phone. So, I called the third person. Now, this third company, excellent. She gave me all the information I needed to know. Um, they match your child with their own individual tutor. They do virtual and in person. They charge by the hour. Um, you get a sibling discount for having two kids enrolled, which I will be having two kids enrolled. So I'll get a discount for that. 
Um, and the price is forty nine. $49 an hour. I personally feel like that's a little expensive, but when it comes to their education, it's worth it. And then, um, oop, you okay? You all right? But, um, yeah, when it comes to their education, it's worth it. So, most likely, we're going to go with this company. Um, I really like the fact that she gave me all the information that she gave me, and then she's even going above and beyond to email me everything that we talked about over the phone via email. That way, I can talk about it with Aaron, and we can make a decision together whether or not we're going to go with this company or whatever, you know. So, I really like her. Shout out to her. I'm not going to tell y'all the company, but shout out to her. I'm very happy with that. So now I'm done with that and I'm about to go and do Elijah's hair. So I'm gonna take y'all with me because his hair is so messed up right now. And I need to wash the boy's hair too, so. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. So yeah, I'm gonna go wash his hair y'all and we will see y'all in a few minutes. All right y'all, so before we get started, I'm gonna show y'all what I use on his hair. So for shampoo, I use this um, kid shampoo and then conditioner. I use this conditioner on their hair. Um, and then I use this, this has been, this bottle has been through it. I don't know what happened at the store, but this kids detangler, this is really, really good. And then after I do that, I put in this Jamaican black like, castor oil water and then I use Jelly Soft Curls. This is really good. And then just to make sure his hair lay down, lays down, I use this. So, and then of course, you gotta have three levels of combs, okay? We start with this, then we go to this, and then we go to this, so. I have all his little stuff here. I have like a pillow, a towel, and a blanket to make sure that you know we're good and I'm about to go take it down. I'm about to go take his hair down.